the new Apple event in under four minutes. Apple Watch Series A was announced. You also have four different colors for the aluminum style. You do have three stainless steel versions. You also have more colors and variations for the Apple Watch bands. You have faster charging, cross detection, blood oxygen, more battery life. Basically, it's a slight upgrade for the Series 7, but still an upgrade. You can order it today and find it on September 16th. You also have the new Apple Watch SE, which gets a slight upgrade as well. You do have three colors, aluminum, space gray, black, and starlight. So similar colors as well on there. And it does match for the back instead of it being a silver or stainless steel. Has a little bit more of those pro features that you get on those higher end models with bigger display, bigger battery life. $249 starts at the same similar price as the previous generation. You can order it today and find it at September 16th. You also have a new Ultra Apple Watch, which has 60 hours of battery life. Basically rugged design. It starts at $799. You can order it today and find it on September 23rd. Now, one of my favorites announced today is the AirPods Pro 2. It has a new H2 chip, which helps with performance, battery life, and everything else like that. Now, you do have customizable spatial audio, which they didn't get into a whole lot, but you basically customize your fitting. They have the same original design as the original. AirPod Pros has double noise cancellation compared to the previous model, a new extra small ear tip included, adaptive transparency mode, 48,000 is registered per second, so it actually will auto detect if there's a loud decibel. You have swipe gestures now to lower and raise volume on the earbuds, longer battery life up to six hours on a single charge and 30 hours on a single charge for the case, which is really good. You also have Find My, which is an introduced feature on the AirPods third gen. You can easily find your device in several different ways. You can easily do it with Find My. Each individual earbud has a speaker and the case has a speaker. You could use MagSafe, your Apple Watch charger, and a lanyard. And this is the specs, H2, 30 hours, touch control, Find My, everything else like that for about 250 bucks, which is previous gen, which is really nice that they keep it the same price. September 9th is when you can order it and you can get it on September 23rd. You could also customize it. And the iPhone 14, one of the main events, but it's not really a main event because it's not really an upgrade. It comes with five different colors. You can see right there, two the, 2 million to 1 aspect ratio, same processor, pretty similar camera, and these are the specs right here. We're not going to get into that because it's basically the same, pretty boring. September 9th is when you can pre-order it, and you can get it on September 16th. For the Plus model, you can get it on the October 7th. Now, for the more exciting thing, in my opinion, is the Pro models. You have a little pill shape here, which actually goes to whatever music or app or charging for anything like that directions face id everything like that this is an amazing game changer it comes in four colors you do have your midnight like an actual black this time silver gold and a deep purple so more of a darker colors this year which is nice you have a pill shape for the notch which is way better 2000 nits brightness which is very bright you have an always on display which actually dims with the wallpaper so you can actually see everything and everything more important and brighter you have all this you have promotion basically everything else like that a16 bionic chip which has better battery life better performance obviously the typical stuff the camera stuff we're not going to get into that because they always just say it's a little bit better a little bit better every year so we're not going to get into too much of that but it is better in low light. They have a new advanced sport mode where you actually can stabilize like a gimbal and it's on both models. And also cinematic mode did get an increase so you can actually shoot in 4K now, 24 and 30. And it starts at the similar prices, $9.99 and what, $10.99. So that's the Apple video today. I just woke up and uh, <laughs> literally I made this video within an hour. So if you guys like this video, like this content, make sure you subscribe for more videos just like this. I will probably do a giveaway in the future. So stay tuned for that. I'll see you guys in the next one and we out.